Hey all, what's going on today? Um, once again, I'm here for another update. Um, went down to the, that store to pick up a couple albums I had on hold that I forgot about. So while I was there, I decided to go check through some of the, the new, newest arrival stuff and I found a couple of things, so I'll, I'll share those with you too. But a uh, little uh, right, not random, little thing in the beginning here. I know my videos have that little clicking sound in them, but I don't have the music, you can hear it. Um, I thought it was the app, I tried several different apps and it's not the app, it's my actual phone. And I can't figure a way to stop it for now. I'm due for an upgrade soon, so I'm just gonna, I'll apologize for that now if that becomes annoying for now. But uh, it'll change soon. And again, I apologize about that. And uh, thank you guys, I mean, I know a lot of you big guys, like Metal Mickey and Vinylizer and Ron Haggerty and uh, Vinyl Transmission and uh, a couple other guys who have made videos for my contest. And uh, I mean, since then I've gotten 14 subscribers. That's you guys, you know, basically advertising for me. So I thank you guys very much. I thank everybody. Um, I again, I'm just blown away by that, but. Anyway, back to the music. Uh, skip all that mushy shit. But anyway, I'm just going to start with uh, YNT, Open Fire. <clears throat> it's a live, live album. Uh, this is a great band. I mean, throughout the all their eras, and they, no matter how what they sound like, they were good. The hair style, the rock style, the hard rock style. I've always loved this band. It's near a sleeve. Vinyl is pretty much mint. It needs to be clean, but other than that, yeah, it looks really good. I uh, should have cover out of the sleeve. In really good shape. Corner of a decent. Uh, I think I paid like five bucks for this, which is good for the, you know, says seven. But uh, that guy always gives me deals. And if you go in there with cash, you get even better deals. I always forget to go in there with cash. But there's that. And this has a bit of a femme fatale. Uh, has a bit of an issue on the front cover. I mean, you can see it has a little tear on that cover there. But, I mean, otherwise, the album's mint. The, uh, got the shitty ass plastic sleeve on it, which I've never understood why they did that. But again, vinyl MCA, typical rainbow. Vinyl is in mint condition, so I figured why not. It's got the hype sticker on it. That, that's the only like, issue is that little tear piece there, but I mean, I can deal with that. Later on, I can always up, up, upgrade it and then trade this one off or send it to somebody who wants it. But, Femme Fatale, really good hair, hard rock album from, I think it was 90, or no, 89. Yeah, from 89. She's got a big voice. I mean, it's a really good, bombastic sounding band. And then I picked up a couple new albums. Uh, oh, I'll put them in sleeves. Uh, see this place I go to? Even their new stuff, they put in sleeves, which I fucking, I love. But uh, anyway, I'm gonna open these, so it'll take me a second. This is Overkill uh, Relic. This is the, uh, Reissued, I'm not sure it was remastered versions, but it's on, uh... Man, these things are so hard sometimes. <laughs> Give me a minute here. <laughs> I swear to God, you don't care and nothing works. There we go. Eventually I get this. Hang on there. 
This is some, listen to some overkill in the background while I'm opening the overkill. Son of a... Oh, almost got it. Nothing better than dead air on the video. Here we go. Alright, let's get this shit off here. I think this is on Koch, Akash, or Records. Got anything I want? No, okay. So, it's a, a gatefold, dual LP. Oh, anyway, there's a cover. It's the back. Gatefold. Pull out the vinyl, see what that looks like. And on basic white sleeves. Uh, it's got a, a custom emblems. That's pretty cool. It says SFM. I could have sworn it was on Koch Records. Anyway, it's a, it's a reissue one. I have to look it up fully. I can't remember what it is. That's one vinyl. I'm pretty sure the other vinyl is going to be the same. Must be a basic stripped down remaster. Yeah, both sleeves are white. Both same. Uh, same white sleeves, boring sleeves. But I get rid of all that. Next is Megadeth's remaster, capital reissue. Uh, I. I am not a fan of this capital. Re I got the uh, Queen's Drug Operation Mindcrime one version of that they did this with, the audio file. Uh, but my, my stereo hates it. It, it seems to lag. Uh, I've never had any other problem with it. Any other, my 180 gram, I have a 200 gram album and nothing happens. Only with that album does that, does that happen. So I don't understand that. So I'm always afraid of these. <laughs> so I hope this one doesn't do that. But anyway, there's the cover. Single disc. Single LP. Oh, that's cool. Sleeve. And the album is a nice polyline sleeve. Yeah, the, re the capital reissues do use my stuff in them. I hope this doesn't bounce all over the place, but... Pretty much looks like the original. Uh, but overall, I'll let you know how that works out. Uh, I think that's it. I don't think there's anything else in these. No, that's it. Let's see the hype stickers for that. Um, that's it for now, guys. Uh, I will be slowing down. I know I keep saying this, but I will be slowing down on the local buying stuff because I, I have so much stuff pre-ordered. Uh, the album just ended. Uh, so much stuff pre-ordered that I'm waiting on, and I want to kind of catch up with that, and then uh, I'll go back to my uh, crack buying. Um, I need to get a lot of work done around here still, too. I kind of bummed it all week. Uh, it's a nice week. I mean, this time of year, usually it's 100 degrees. We've been lucky that has been like 80 to 85 all week. So I've kind of been screwing off outside. And... But anyway, thanks again, and uh, I'll update shit as it comes in. And uh, I think I got five or six people so far for the contest. So you still got a good chance. I mean, that's really good odds. Uh, I think most people that have made a video have two entries. I think only one's a newer, uh, yeah, I think only one so far is a newer uh, subscriber. But again, I'm going to ramble here because this is what I do at the end of the videos because I try to think of the shit to say and I forget. But anyway, thanks again guys. Uh, I've really been enjoying this obviously. Um, I know I put up a lot of videos but I, I just keep buying stuff and I enjoy it. Anyway, I'm done. Bye. Bye.
you're listening to Overkill's new album. That's what was playing in the background, uh, the grinding wheel. Uh, it's actually really good. I know people, uh, oh, of course I'm going to fit the name on the one before us. A lot of people didn't like the one before, which I don't get, but um, this one's really good. The first opening track is uh, Mean, Green, Mean Green Killing Machine. I love that song. Uh, I think I heard some of it in the beginning of it. I don't know when that album kicked in on the video, but that's what it was playing in the background. Talking, rambling, bye.